So this sink drain right here is actually siliconed in place. And today I'm going to show you how to take that out. I've had a lot of requests to do this and I just wanted to show everybody how to do it. Hey folks, that fix it guy here. And today I want to show you how to remove a siliconed in pop-up assembly. That is AKA a siliconed in sink drain for a bathroom sink. So join me today as I'm going to show you how to take this out. This is a simple, easy process, takes a little bit of muscle, but really once you have the technique down, no problem. So come along, let's get to fixing. Okay, so the first thing I like to do is just we'll take a towel, put a towel down, just catch some water and put a little bucket there. Okay, and then you wanna take the P-trap off. You can totally usually do this with just your hand. That should typically be hand tight. But if it is not hand tight and it's hard, then just go ahead and grab a pair of tongue and groove pliers and you can just simply put this on there and just give it a little twist. Do the same thing right here. And we'll go ahead and we'll just drop this P-trap. Got something there to catch the water, which is very nice. If you guys like this kind of content please jump on in here subscribe to the channel we're just trying to help people out and really hope that we're doing that so you can see that that right there is silicone in place so the first thing we want to do is we're going to want to take this arm right here off and to do that you want to grab up top with one hand and unloosen this counterclockwise with the other hand take this bar right here you know, drop that down, just let that hang right there. Then you can just grab this from the top and remove it. We're gonna go ahead and remove this extension tube. So just loosen that up and it should be able to slide right off. Just set that aside. We're gonna grab our tongue and groove pliers and we're just gonna go ahead and we're gonna loosen this nut up. And once you get it loose, you'll just be able to loosen the whole thing up, take it all the way to the bottom. Okay, so then what I like to do is I like to take this and just grab it and just start pushing up. Back and forth rocking motion. And it's gonna come out. Once you get it popped up high enough, you're able to remove the top piece. So now you got this piece up a little bit. You can see that gap. So then you just grab this piece right here and you just take this hand and you just spin this counterclockwise to get it out of there. Okay, once that's apart, that's just gonna come right out and drop down. And then you'll be able to grab this right here and you're just able to pull this right out. And you can see that there is actually no silicone to this and it all has really stuck to right here. This right here, you're able to just take it. And for the most part, the whole thing is just gonna peel right off. All right, you got a little bit of residual right there, but it's not bad. We'll just clean that off. And we're gonna be able to put that, we're gonna be able to put a new one right on after we wipe that out and get it dry. Then what I do is just clean some water off right there, get all that hooked up. And if I needed to actually scrub anything off of it, I just grab one of these green scrubbies, right? Just go around that. There's actually nothing on there though. And it's good to rock and roll, man. Okay, so for this down here, I just grab a little paper, wipe out the inside of this. You wanna get all that cleaned out. And you want to get this silicone off of here. You can scrape this off by hand. Like it, it comes off fairly easy. I mean, it's really not that bad. See, most of it's just coming right off in bigger chunks. Um, or just grab a putty knife and you know make a quick job of it. Okay, so you can see that there's actually no silicone around this anymore. I've taken it all off from both the top and the bottom. 
And now we can go ahead and we can reinstall this. Once you've got a good little understanding of how to get this apart, it really is very simple. I've never had a big issue with doing this at all. Okay, folks, that is how you remove a siliconed bathroom sink drain, aka a pop-up assembly, okay? I have a great video for it. I'll post a link up here and down in the description box for how to install one. If you guys need that, please go check it out. I'll also put a link in the description box below for a tube of silicone. This stuff is great for bathroom, kitchen. I like to use clear. It works out really well for this particular application. And a few more, all right? I'll also hook up the set of Cobra Canipex pliers in the description box below, right? I bought these on a three pack. Actually, I didn't buy them. I got them as a gift on Amazon three pack for Father's Day. Worked out awesome. I bought the little Canipex Cobra um, everyday carries that I use, the little six inches, and those things are awesome. So now I have four sets of these and I love them. They're a tool that I never knew that I wanted, man. They are just, they're solid, quality tool. You spend some bucks. It is what it is. I really hope you guys enjoy the video. If you could please subscribe to the channel, click the like button. We would greatly appreciate it. Thank you very much, and I'll see you again real soon.